An eight day mission turned into nine months in space. Astronauts Butch Wilmore and Suni Williams remain in limbo at the International Space Station. Captain Butch Wilmore is a graduate of both the University of Tennessee and Tennessee Tech. Again, this is liftoff. He and fellow astronaut Suni Williams left Earth back on June 5th. Then once they were in space, NASA and Boeing announced their spaceship wouldn't return on schedule. They cited failures with the thrusters and the Starliner did return without them back in September. Then on the 13th of September, the astronauts spoke for the first time from space saying they were making the best of the situation. Um, if I can't affect it, if there's nothing we can do, there's nothing we can do. So we march forward, carry out the plan of the day, as we used to say back in my AOCS days and, 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 and shortly thereafter. Um, aviation Officer Candidate School, by the way, that's what that means. <laughs> SUNY Williams' hair makes her look like Medusa, doesn't it? <laughs> in December, NASA did announce a new target return date for this month. In January, President Trump posted on social media that billionaire Elon Musk and his company SpaceX would be the ride home for those stranded Americans. NASA confirmed SpaceX would switch capsules and speed up the return mission. But again, that was supposed to happen yesterday they scrubbed the launch citing a hydraulic problem so the next window is tomorrow night but no confirmation on timing right now we'll certainly keep you posted